Thank you to our viewers who are glued to their TVs or their computers, I should say. Perfect. This viewer says that this watch started off with a bang. The name of per Permoid? Permoid? Yeah, but then he then, then there has been changes because then he called it I think it's a, I think it's a just a piece. I so think it's a type of octocoral. Take a closer look of this shell here. Oh, well, the, the I don't know if that's the actual animal itself. This one might be alive. So I think it's live. Yeah. It could be the foot of the yeah. snail. So interesting. Yeah. Looks like it is. It's nice. So that's unusual. We don't see a lot of gastropods or snails on the seafloor like this. This is a good size. Not really making tracks, that's for sure. But yeah. So we're getting a close-up view of the sediment surface. Looks like there's a mixture of dark and light yeah. material. Yeah, from the, so yeah. the light well, with some I pteropod tests. I don't know what what's the dark. I wonder what purpose they have. Is that for like catching prey or yeah. knowing that the prey is there? I read one extra um, yeah. something. That's great. Where yeah. they use Alex. those um, pectoral fins exactly. to yeah. sweep the food to the mouth. Okay. Yeah, it looked like there. they could be little. It looks like it has very big eyes. Or something. Maybe it's an ophiroid. Nope, it's the polychaete tube. You can see the tube. Yeah, there. yeah. And there's a, looks like a dead cup coral on it. It's really pitted. Yeah, we're, we'll take it. There's another polychaete the tube. The jeweler's okay. turn. Yeah. I love this. The jeweler's turn. It's amazing. Every rock has so Lots much life on it, you know, yep. that it's kind of hard to... That's another green sponge over there. Yep. Yeah. And what's a light one also? Then another one, another sponge, and then that knobby bit that was coming off the side on the right yeah. side is a yeah. cup coral. Well, that yeah. was... It's dead. Uh, uh, 